Hi, it's Joe again. Uh, so today we'll look into more um, deeper details on Acer F900. So previously I have shown you the Acer Shell 2.0. So right now I'm going to go deeper and let's see what Acer has installed underneath the Shell 2.0. So to start with, let's go to program. Okay, this is the program. Let me scroll up. Okay, uh, some of the things that are different from the uh, Windows 6.1 is, let's for example, this multimedia. As you can see, there's a FM tuner here. Okay, the for the FM tuner, right? You have to get a headset. So right now, I'm not using any headset, but you can see that it's working. So let's close it. Name card manager. Okay, this is the name card manager. I have not seen this before. Uh, to tell the truth, I have tried to use it, um, but the lighting is not so good and um, it's a not a very good review on it. So I'm not going to it. I may try it later, but uh, this name card is uh, not so important to me at this moment. Next streaming player as you can see it's a RTSP that makes a streaming video or streaming uh, information okay let's, let's get out of here let's go to the phone okay on the phone you can see some um, standard things sim card manager SNS sender and etc etc okay. nothing much also okay for utility okay you can see there's an application recovery so I guess uh, Acer has done something here for their own program It's quite a lot. Next is backup. So in my opinion, it may be like a spirit backup from HTC. So default setting, okay, is to help you to uh, get back to your default or factory setting. So there's some code that you have to enter before you can activate memory. So you can see uh, it has a program to help you to optimize your memory. Task manager. So this task manager is um, an enhanced version. So uh, actually there's a wizard or a bun. So I prefer to use the advanced right now. Okay, finally this uh, GPS. So you can see this uh, GPS compass. Okay, let me go to satellite. Uh, quite nice, but at this moment I'm in indoor, so there will not be any GPS signal. Okay. Go to the box. Okay, notice that there's a blinking light right now. I don't know whether you can see it here. It shows that the GPS is working. Okay, this and here it shows some signal here. It shows that there's a SIM card installed and the phone is working also ok let's get out here move on ok this is Acer Shell as mentioned Acer Shell is uh, is uh, quite nice on the outlook but um, at times I feel that the it's taking out a lot of RAM 
and uh, sometimes you just need to unload it to use the simple Windows 6.1 if you like so Acer has given this option to you to use or not to use it okay it's Acer Shell version 1 but I was told that um, what we have is version Acer Shell 2.0 so I do not know what the 2.0 means anyway let me move on uh, sad to say there is nothing much on the calculator there is no enhancement and also on the game side no other games except for the standard games and you notice that it's using CE star okay mm. notification manager so this is something like uh, to get the updates but I seriously I don't know which what update they are going to get uh, I've done that check now but um, nothing going next you can see there's quick launch quick menu these are the menu that uh, Acer has done it and I have shown it in the previous video so I'm not going to go about it next you have um, zoom ok this zoom is um, when you press it right it just appear and it's actually uh, the zoom is actually the zoom what is on top of this let me show you again what is on top of this uh, status here so for example when I press it you can see that it activates the task manager ok I have to close the calculator ok press again ok let me close press again you can see ok that's about it Next, I move on to setting. Okay, these are settings. Okay, almost the same. Okay, now we have a today soft key. So, in my opinion, this is uh, actually the key, uh, the, the the soft key that is on the bottom here, whereby you can change it on the today screen. So, I'm not going to do anything right now. Cancel. On this, you can see almost the same. Okay, there's a gravity sensor here. Press. So, so on the gravity sensor, you can actually choose the activity that you wanted. Okay. There's quite a lot of things that you can do, but I'm not going to change anything here. And also, there's a power. finger deep scrolling and pending okay. and here is the system information I'll do a screen capture on all those uh, system information later on the connection side um, no difference I think so I'm not going to go about it. Okay, that's about it. Thank you very much.